we're going to talk for a moment about baseline pressures. And whenever we're measuring a pressure to outdoors and we have a consistent bias pressure, we need to try and zero that out of our calculations. This is an example here. We're in a relatively cold day around freezing. I have a minus 2.2 Pascal bias pressure and we're going to try and get rid of that using the baseline function. We press the baseline key and it says acquiring up here. We'll acquire this baseline for a few seconds. It depends on how much it's fluctuating. If it's fluctuating a lot, we need to acquire it for a long period of time. This one's staying quite stable at around minus 2 pascals, which means there's probably very little wind, but there's a lot of pressure due to stack. So at any point we can press enter to accept this baseline. And you will now notice that the pressure that we're reading is only 0.4 pascals, so the minus 2 pascals that we're showing before has evaporated because the baseline pressure that we've acquired has eliminated the bias pressure that we've been experiencing. This is a step that should be undertaken anytime that we do a test where we're taking a tube outdoors.